Bob. How are you today? Hi, Alice. I'm doing well, thank you. How about you? I'm good, thanks for asking. It's a beautiful day, isn't it? It really is. The sun is shining and there's not a cloud in the sky. That's right. Speaking of the weather, isn't it amazing how it can change from day to day? Yes, it's fascinating. The weather plays such a big role in our lives, doesn't it? It surely does. I thought we could have a discussion about it. What do you think? Sounds like a great idea, Alice. I would love to discuss the weather. So, as we mentioned, it's a sunny day today. The sky is so clear and blue, and it's quite warm. Yes, it's a perfect summer day. I must say I enjoy this kind of weather. It's not too hot, but it's nice and warm. What about you, Alice? I like it too, Bob. It makes me feel happy and energetic. Plus, it's great weather for a picnic or a nice walk in the park. Absolutely. On days like this, I enjoy going for a bike ride or having a barbecue with my family. It's a good break from the usual indoor activities. Sounds fun. The weather indeed changes our plans. Like, I prefer to do my shopping on sunny days. How about you? Does the weather influence your daily routine? Definitely. When it's sunny, I like to spend time outside. It's a good opportunity to get some fresh air and enjoy the nature. But when it's cold or rainy, I usually stay indoors, maybe read a book or watch a movie. That's interesting, Bob. The weather really does have an impact on our daily activities. Speaking of weather, we see such different weather in each season, don't we? Absolutely. Each season has its own unique weather. Like in the spring, everything is blooming and it's usually mildly warm. And then comes summer, like now, with sunny and hot days perfect for beach trips. Right, then the leaves start to fall in autumn. It gets a bit chilly, but the colors of the trees are just beautiful. Yes, and finally, winter brings cold and often snow, especially here in the north. Exactly. Which one is your favorite season, Alice? I'd say spring. I love seeing nature wake up after winter. The flowers, the green leaves, it's all very refreshing. How about you, Bob? 
For me, it's autumn. I enjoy the crisp air and the beautiful fall colors. Plus, it's harvest season, which reminds me of apple picking with my family when I was a child. That sounds lovely. It's really amazing how each season gives us different experiences. Yes, that's true. And speaking of different experiences, sometimes weather can be quite extreme as well, can't it? You're right, Alice. We have storms, hurricanes, heat waves, blizzards, and many other types of extreme weather. That's true. For instance, a hurricane is a powerful storm with strong winds that forms over the ocean. And a blizzard is a severe snowstorm with very strong and cold winds. Exactly. And then there are heat waves that are periods of excessively hot weather, which can be dangerous if we don't stay cool and hydrated. Have you ever experienced any extreme weather, Alice? Yes, I have experienced a heat wave once. It was quite challenging to stay cool. I tried to drink plenty of water and stay indoors as much as possible. What about you, Bob? I remember a big snowstorm when I was a kid. We couldn't leave our house for a few days until the roads were cleared. It was quite an adventure. That must have been something. Extreme weather like that can really impact our lives and the environment. Absolutely, Alice. It can lead to things like power outages, damage to houses, and even affect wildlife. It's important for us to be prepared and stay safe. You're absolutely right, Bob. And you know, these extreme weather conditions are also related to a bigger issue, which is climate change. Yes, I've heard about that. Climate change is a long-term change in average weather patterns, right? Yes, and it's caused mostly by human activities, like burning fossil fuels, which release greenhouse gases into the atmosphere. These gases trap heat and cause the planet to get warmer, which is known as global warming. I see. So, is this why we're experiencing more extreme weather? Exactly. As the planet warms, weather patterns can change, causing more intense and frequent extreme weather events. This can be harmful to people, animals, and plants. That sounds serious. What can we do to help? We can all contribute in small ways. Things like recycling, reducing our energy use, and choosing sustainable products can make a difference. It's also important to stay informed and help others understand the issue. That sounds like a plan, Alice. It's important for us to take care of our planet. That's very true, Bob. You know, weather not only affects our daily lives and environment, but also our culture and festivities. Oh, that's interesting. Can you give me some examples? 
Sure. Think about how different the celebrations are in summer compared to winter. Summer festivals often have outdoor concerts, picnics, and fireworks, while winter celebrations often involve cozy indoor gatherings, hot drinks, and hearty food. That's a great point. I also recall that some cultures have traditional beliefs or superstitions about the weather. Exactly. For example, in some cultures, rain is considered good luck, especially on special occasions like weddings. It's believed to symbolize fertility and cleansing. And let's not forget about the numerous holidays tied to the seasons. For instance, in the United States, we have Groundhog Day, which is all about predicting the weather. Absolutely. The weather has such a significant role in our lives, doesn't it? It certainly does, Alice. It affects so many aspects of our life and culture. Yes, it's amazing to think about how much the weather influences our lives, from our daily activities to our culture and even our environment. I agree, Alice. I've never thought about the weather in such a detailed way before. I'm glad we had this discussion. Me too, Bob. It's interesting to explore how something so common as the weather has such a big impact. Absolutely. Well, I should head out now. It was great talking with you, Alice. You too, Bob. Enjoy the beautiful weather. Goodbye. Goodbye, Alice.